Ja. Mi dispiace. It's locked. Shit, it was open earlier. Now what? Can we pick it? No, it's electronic. We're gonna have to find another way in. You see that? Key card, back left pocket. Yep. I'm on it. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. You sure you wanna do that? There's a lot of eyes out here. I think I can handle a simple lift. All right. Oh, real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. Doubted me. Pleasure to watch professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. It's so out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Date? You catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Dean Ross? Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run-in with them. It's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You, uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Yeah, find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. Crap. You see a waiter in there? Nah, just more heavily armed goons. This escape wasn't on the blueprint. <clears throat> Locked, of course. Okay, plan B. There you go. Let's see 
some fence up there. Here we go. Let there be light. Bad electrical in this joint. Don't suppose you brought a... Yeah, that'll do. I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. That's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not gonna fly. Hey, uh, she'll be worried that Victor is chatting up Nadine Ross. I mean, I've heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. There you go. This way. Hey, look, the vents. That's our way out. <laughs> yep, let's find something to climb on. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding the lighter. Holding the lighter. Okay, up we go. All right, there. A bit smaller than it looked, huh? And a lot more dusty. Shh, shh, shh. Damn it. Waiters. And Baldy looks like my size, too. There's no shortage of waiters around here. I check with the Fresh air, here we come. Hey, check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. <laughs> Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. <clears throat> All right. Good thing you kept in shape.
There you go. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? It must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Bingo. Found the kitchen. And of course... Sam, look. Maybe we can use that to find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilian, Sam. What? Right. So he wakes up with a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. It's not a... <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? Sully? Great. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. You got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> <laughs> Recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex partner. Mm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh, like dead out? Oh, no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan. How the hell are you? Rafe. How long has it been? 10 years? 12? 15. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. Oh, <laughs> that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big score. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah, I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but um, <clears throat> just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. 
We'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Zoe. How'd you find out about it? It? And what it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. Now, I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn fight. Right. <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? Nate? God damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this. No. God, why did I pick the power room? Ecco fatto. Oh, speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Here we go. Now. Where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid. Where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? He won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once, going twice. Screw it. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. And for a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. But with what? Now the bid has reached 130,000. Okay. Nope. We are now at 140. Your Nothing. Senior, Damn it. All the way to 150,000 euros. There's gotta be something. Come on. Hey, man, uh, I'm starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, Fitting give me a second. 160,000 euros in the room. 
Yes. Seniority's bid makes 170,000. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. Gotcha. And now it is 190,000 euros. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid, 200,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? <laughs> Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once, going twice, then I shall sell it for 500,000 And ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak Spanish. Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. are everywhere. <laughs> okay, maybe we should have brought guns. and get a good vantage point. Merda, se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma un attimo. Poi... Si è mosso qualcosa lì. Sì, penso tu abbia ragione. Ho trovato qualcosa? Se c'era qualcuno è sparito. Higher ground to get my bearings. 
I'll see you soon. Yeah. There's the ballroom. Driveway's right in front. Okay. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh. Scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what. I won't tell anyone. If you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would... Oh! You'd want. <coughs> All right, fine. <clears throat> Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. <coughs> <coughs> then telegraph some. <coughs> <coughs> nice try. I gave you that one. <coughs> the artifact. Do you know how many artifacts I've collected over the years? <laughs> You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify! Alright, look. I'm still a little jet-lagged. How about we just call it even? Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. Alright, wait, wait! It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there! <laughs> All right, I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? Uh, just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Uh, I just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? Look by the ball. Look for the this the round button. sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> What are you doing? What's this look like? Oh, shit. Nathan! Catch! Wait, what? Oh, crap. Hey, I got it! Nice shot. Nice shoot! You all right? Yeah. Hanging in there. <laughs> I can't get to you from here. You got a way down? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Okay, I'll meet you at the driveway. Just head towards the ballroom. All right, see you there. You fatty, man. 